Hi everyone, this game is called I Woke Up Next To You Again. I woke up next to... him. Oh, I like that. I moved to a new place recently and found someone. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> I woke up next to him again. I mean, he's got a nice face, I suppose. He told me, hey, this, this is a one-time thing. I have this and that, and I said, of course, me too. Well, this sounds like my life experiences. <laughs> Yet, here we are. Hi. Uh oh, your eyes are so pretty. That was pretty good. Wait, is that too needy? <laughs> Feelings mutual. Look, it's been great and all, but it'd be best for both of us if we kept this to a two-night stand. Oh. 30 minute stand, you mean? Okay, um, shall I be harsh? No, I'll play it cool. I'll just be like, sure, whatever. No time for that. It's complicated stuff. Hey, great idea. I'll add you on Facebook and put our status as it's complicated. <laughs> just kidding. Yeah. Uh. Ugh. I'm gonna be late. Where are my pants? Where the fuck did I put the... <sighs> They're on my dresser. Oh no, I'll just be sarcastic and be like, they've magically disappeared. Your pants have magically disappeared. <laughs> You're real helpful. I'd say see ya, but uh, well, goodbye. Shall I be a bit needy and just be like, want to stay for breakfast? Yeah, fuck it. Want to stay for breakfast? I make the most amazing waffles, pancakes, anything you want. I've been told I'm a really good cook. Uh, 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 let's go, I can't deny free food. See? I use my food charm. Every man loves food. It's the way to his heart, you know. I cooked us breakfast conversation wasn't as awkward as I thought it'd be. I wouldn't mind having it again. I didn't tell him that. He left. I kept meeting him after that. Not on purpose. We just seemed to be in the right place at the right time. Stalker lad. He'd say something like, What a coincidence, nice to see you again. And I reply, Want to come to my place? Yeah, you want to come over to my place? We can uh, have some sexy time. He was charming and, you know, everyone digs that. I can never refuse. I felt so tired afterwards. It doesn't feel good anymore. But we still do it. Morning. I've been thinking. I'm ready to make a commitment to our relationship or repeated one night stands. <laughs> that joke is not funny. What about you? I don't know. This is a bit dodgy. It sounds a bit dodgy. But YOLO, right? Me too. I'm ready for this relationship to level up. Awesome. So... There's a gap in my phone contacts that's just waiting to be filled. Want to fill it? Uh, I'm gonna be like cool here, be like no. No, sorry. Actually, I changed my mind. Really? I thought we had a thing going on. I'm just... I'm going to miss you. I hope you miss me too. Do, 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 do. He's 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 gaslighting me. He's gaslighting me. If anyone doesn't know what gaslighting is, please Google it. You will find the best definition. 
I'll miss you too, I suppose. You will. So, can we meet again? Um, yeah. Maybe that makes me weak, but I've changed my mind. Again. You're not weak. You're just following your heart. Oh god, after that, everything began to remind me of him. If he wasn't there, I felt aimless, restless. I forgot what I'd been doing. My hopes, my ambitions. Before I met him... One day, I wake up feeling sluggish. Head pounding. I've never felt like this before. I automatically turn to call him. I know he'll make it better. Or will he make it worse? Of course not. <laughs> this is getting a bit cl too close to home here. I'm probably going to call him because I'm like that. Hey, um, I need you. Please come over. No. What? I don't need him. I, j I just want him to be here. Why would... <sighs> Years pass. I can't remember much. My friends, my family. Their talk, but I won't listen. All I remember is him. Man, well, that's a toxic relationship if I know. <laughs> okay, right. We're going to try that again, and we're going to go with the opposite to what we just did, just to see how it'd be different. Let's start again. I could wake up. Yes, I woke up. Where? Dot. Him. Okay. Sexy man in my bed. I moved to a new place recently. And I found someone. Someone sexy. I woke up next to him again. He told me. Hey, this is a one-time thing. I have this and that and all this bullshit. And I said, yeah, of course, me too. Wonderful. Yet here we are. You should get going. Yeah, just one thing. It's been great and all, but it'd be best for both of us if we kept this to a two-night stand. You know what? Whatever, sure. No time for that, it's complicated stuff. Hey, great idea. I right, on Facebook. Put you as complicated. Hey, just kidding. Shit, I've got to go because now I have errands to run. Where are my pants? I threw them out the window. I think I threw your pants out the window. Oh, great. I'd say see ya, but well, goodbye. Bye. I see ya. I kept meeting him after that. Not on purpose. We just seem to be in the right places at the right time. He'd say something like, What a coincidence, nice to see you again and again and again. I wasn't stalking your Facebook at all. And I reply, Get lost, you creep. I've got to go. I, I've got to go. Maybe a bit blunt, but there was something off about him. So I stopped anything from developing before it was too late. The end. Oh, oh, how many endings are there? Okay, guys, next ending. All right. This is a really cool game, by the way. The artist is absolutely, oh my gosh, just so talented. You, Missy, are very talented. And you're younger than me as well, so that makes me even feel really bad. <laughs> okay, I woke up. Can we, can we, like, him? All right, let's try the five minutes thing. Moved to a new place recently, found someone. Hello, sir, how you doing? Would you like a cup of tea in the morning? He'd tell me, blah, 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 and that. Yes, of course, me too. Yet here we are again. That was pretty fucking good. That was pretty good. Feelings mutual. Look, it's been great. 
blah 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 man talking man things I said I'm gonna say 30 minutes stand you mean because you can't last longer than five <laughs> we lasted longer than that I did you didn't keep up my sex drive all right where'd I put my pants you know what you did with your pants you set them alight uh did I say bye last time? Or I said see ya? I say bye. Ciao. I kept meeting him after that. We'd just randomly walk into each other. He'd say something like, Oh, this is crazy. I just met you. Okay, I'm, let's go grab a drink. Same. Wanted to go for a drink? He was charming. I could never refuse. I felt so tired afterwards. It doesn't feel good anymore, but we still do it. Morning. <laughs> I've been thinking. I'm ready to make a commitment to our relationship with repeated one night stands. <laughs> what about you? Uh, me too. I'm ready for this relationship. Awesome. So, there's a gap in my phone. Do you want to be filling it? Of course I do. Here's my number. Call me. I'm open between 10 a.m. and 9 p. Wow. Jesus. What, no midnight shifts? A face like this requires work? Gotta get my beauty sleep. As much as I've gotten tired of it all, I can't let go. It's a habit I'm not willing to break. What's that voiceover? It's like a police, um, police background. I don't know if it's the music or it's connected to the story. After that, everything began to remind me of him. If he wasn't there, I felt aimless, re less restless. I forgot what I'd been doing. My hopes, my ambitions, my dreams, everything before I met him. One day I wake up feeling really sluggish, head pounding. I've never felt like this before. I automatically turn to call him. I know him make it better. He always makes it better. Or will he make it worse? Of course not. Don't call him. Be strong. In a sudden moment of clarity, I pause. Take a breath. Don't call him. I, I don't know how I got through the day, but I did. I can't call him again. Mm. Okay, let's go. I'll call him tomorrow. Years pass. Okay, I can't remember much. I can't remember my friends, my family. They, they talk, but I don't listen. All I remember is him. Everywhere I go. Well... That was actually an interesting game about toxic relationships, and I kind of related to that in some, in some way. <laughs> uh, if you related to this or you want to play this, I will link the game below, and I thank the artist for creating this beautiful game, and I hope there's another one. Thank you for watching, guys, and I'll see you soon.